Good morning, Long Beach, and welcome to STN. I'm Desmond Howard. And I'm Carmila Figueroa, and thank you so much for joining us today on our special edition show where we're reporting right here from sunny California. Well, kicking off our show, we head to a delicious bakery for our furry friends. Next, a barbershop where the experience is so much more than just a haircut. And finally, Chris Sanchez takes us on a tour of Long Beach. Don't go anywhere because we've got all of these stories and more on, on Raider, Raider 305. 305. Camila, I know I have quite the sweet tooth. Well, after taking your dog to this spot, you may find out they do too. On Lee Santini kicks off our show. We all love a good bakery, and here, on 2nd Street in downtown Long Beach, this bakery caters to a different crowd. The smells from their baked goods was very attractive to our dogs. So it's, as you can tell, they love walking by and they just automatically veer to the shop. So that's kind of how we came upon it because our dogs noticed it first. <laughs> They're running. They're running. <laughs> That happens a lot with people, yeah. Their dog will actually drag them in, and they're like, what is this place? And then they just stay for a while because it's just like a unique, different type of environment. What do you guys want? And why are these dogs so eager to get inside? It might have something to do with the sweet treats that accommodate almost every puppy's palate. We don't use any salt, butter, sugar, or chocolate, and any of our treats besides that, we do use human ingredients for everything. First of all, they have dog treats and they're like, I feel like a human could even eat them sometimes because on how appetizing they look, and I mean, but I mean, they're for dogs and it's really nice. My dog's allergic to hide and when I walked in here and I'm like, oh my God, hopefully they have hide free treats. They have a whole section for them. And these owners enjoy celebrating the important milestones. You know, having a dog, you meet a lot of dog parents. And so that's the great thing is like, it does, we do talk about it. We're like, hey, you know, your dog's having a birthday. They have cupcakes. That, at the dog bakery. <laughs> a lot of people love their dogs like their kids. So they want to celebrate, they just want to spoil them. Like we have what you want here. From delicious cupcakes to healthy birthday cakes, your furry friend can get the best of both worlds right here at the dog bakery. For Raider Vision, I'm Emily Santini reporting. <laughs> they say barbershop talk is the best talk and the Belmont Barber Company is the talk of the town. Jordan Bankson has the story. A fresh haircut. Customers here describe it as the best feeling. But there's more to the experience than just the combs and the clippers. Everyone makes me feel welcome, so um, pretty much the first step I walk in, so yeah. And this sense of belonging is all created by the barbers. I think that just the greeting itself, as soon as they come in, making sure that they feel seen, you know, just a simple like, hey, how's it going, you know. We've got a pretty tight-knit group of barbers in here, um, so it's kind of cool to just like come into work and cut hair. I, I know most of my clients, and then I'm friends with all of, all of the barbers in here, and we just get to kind of hang out all day. It's pretty cool, so. The barbers are really, really, really smart, clever, really rich lives. You know, and they bring a lot of themselves into every conversation and every haircut. And these conversations can have a lasting impact. I talked to my barber about, about love right. difficulties and my love difficulties and how they related, considering they came from quite different places. Concluded that dating is pretty similarly dysfunctional, regardless of where you're from. And all of these conversations give the customers a feeling that his barbershop is a cut above the rest. This is, this is probably the best place in Long Beach as far as I'm concerned. And they were like, well, what other places have you tried? And I was like, I haven't tried any because I found my barbershop on the first go. From great cuts to even better conversations, this popular barbershop shows that the talk of the town starts right in these seats. Ah, thank you, sir. That was perfect. Parade Vision, I'm Jordan Bankson, reporting. After the break, Chris Sanchez takes us to see the sights and sounds here at Long Beach. We'll be right back. Welcome to sunny California, where the people are fearless. Experience. 
explore downtown Long Beach. Next, Chris Sanchez takes us along his hectic morning here at STN. Take it away. Talk of the town, talk of the town. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go take a little walk. Try and brainstorm some ideas. Oh, man. Oh, the, the swans. I'll, I'll go on the swans. What's up guys, how was it? It's fun. I'm about to get on it, but I don't, I don't got a date though. I'm kind of alone. No date for me. I'm very alone. This is not. This is not helping me get my stress out. Like, I'm, this is just. If anything, this is just making it worse. This one ride is just not what I thought it was going to be. I'm probably going to go to something else. I love you. Even though you didn't help me out at all. In order to clear my head and plan out what I want to do. I figured that getting a yummy treat would give me some brain power. I'm a little stressed out right now. Got a lot going on, so I'm gonna take a scooter ride, a little scooter ride. Sheesh! Unfortunately, the clock is still ticking, and I'm starting to run out of time. This is a lot of stress for me right now. I thought I was done for but then it finally clicked. Camila! Desmond! I picked what I'm gonna make my story about, guys. Just letting you know. I'm glad I came up with something. And when I finish the segment, it'll for sure be the talk of the town. I'm ready. Got my story ready. Got my plans in line. I'm ready, I'm excited. Just gotta, oh my gosh. I forgot to put the SD cards in. Thanks, Chris. I think we're done here for today. Yup, that's a wrap. We'll see you next time on, on Raider 305. 305.